you guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel, Simply Sasha 4 and 4 here. And if you are new to my channel, my name is Sasha. So glad that you clicked on my video. In today's video, it's going to be a back to school video. I know. It's kind of sad that it's almost that time, but it is getting closer, guys, and we have to face the facts that school is about to start. So, I have a video for you guys. I have five tips for incoming freshmen or ingoing freshmen because I'm not in high school anymore. But I have some tips for you guys. But before we get into the tips, make sure you guys hit that red subscribe button button it's free join the family be a part of it and then don't forget to hit that notification bell next to it so that you are notified when I upload a new video every Thursday and go ahead and thumbs up this video if you're excited to hear my five tips don't forget to follow me on my social media because that is cool and it's always linked down below follow me on my Instagram and see no snapchat all that so if you're excited for this video then sit tight and let's get into it okay guys Freshmen, fresh meat. I'm talking to you. I don't know why I just went into a, like a New York accent, but <laughs> yes. So I'm here to give you five tips that I think are just probably might be generic. You probably heard it before, but I thought it would be nice to say it again or tell you guys if you hadn't heard it before. So I have five tips. First tip don't be afraid to make new friends and possibly lose old ones i know it's really cool and it seems really cool to like transition from middle school to high school with your core group of friends that you've had you know your whole life almost sometimes you've had those middle school friends since you were in elementary but with high school it's a bigger like i want to say stadium it's a bigger place and a lot of different middle schools are going to like maybe your specific high school that you're going to so just be open to making new friends you might meet um i don't want to say better friends but other friends that you might connect with and are going to be your lifelong friends forever or you might not but you just want to be open to you know making new friends and possibly losing old friends because everybody from your middle school is not going to attend your high school that did happen to me a lot of my friends either moved away to another state um, went to a different we're zoned for a different high school so it happens so just you know just know that it's life and it happens to everybody you know making new friends is not that bad and losing some is it hurts for a little if you were really close but it, it gets better trust me tip number two is grades matter your freshman year please do not be like me I thought I was moving um for freshman year I thought I was gonna move to Georgia my freshman year of high school but I didn't I ended up staying one more year in my hometown so I was excited I was like I'm gonna have fun I'm gonna remember this year because I'm moving so I, I did okay but I didn't pay as much as attention as I should have and I didn't realize how important it is to get good grades your freshman year it is super super important it sets up the rest of your like high school career basically like the way your classes are going to be set up you know your senior year if you want to take like no classes at all you really need to pay attention and focus and do really really good in on your fresh in your freshman year i really wish um i paid more attention and did much better my freshman year but do better than me do do better than me stay focused and pay attention get them you know like go to your counselor see what you need to do like stay on track don't get behind your freshman year because it sucks trying to catch up tip number three get involved with different clubs and activities not only will this help you make friends and see what you're good at and what you're passionate about it will also look good on your college transcripts and you know applications and things like that it always looks good that you've joined a lot of clubs especially if you join clubs that are pertaining to what you want to do or like what you want to go to college and pursue you know your job wise um, I believe that it is so fun to like do like a sport you know or like band or chorus i did chorus so i'm gonna plug that cheerleading i didn't do cheerleading in high school but i did coach it and i did it like you know rec and my but my sister she cheered high school and it's really fun and also like you know clubs like i think my sister was in key club um running for president or something like that being in that kind of club or like what is that club it's not it's like what is it called? I don't remember. If I remember, I'll put it here. But it's like the people who are in the 
secretary and all that, that club. Just try to get involved. It's fun and it looks good on your college transcripts. Tip number four. Don't worry about getting lost. It's normal and you won't be lost for long. Um, usually I think they let you like go to the school and walk around and fami familiarize, familiarize yourself with the campus that you're on. So don't feel intimidated or like worried about somebody watching you and thinking oh she don't know she go oh that's a freshman it's okay girl because they were a freshman too at one point and i'm sure they got lost too so don't don't let that bother you just you know focus you'll find it and you won't be lost for long it, it get pretty easy to like find your way so yeah and then tip number five is upperclassmen will not bully you or be rude to you so don't be afraid to talk to them um i think that's like a one like I'm not gonna say all freshmen are gonna like not be rude because I don't know. But when I was in, when I was a freshman, we had uh, my PE class, my gym class. We had a mixed gym class. It was all classes: ninth, tenth, eleventh, twelfth grade kids in there. Uh, me and my friend became really cool with some juniors, and they were nice. They talked to you like they're some of them, uh, especially a lot of them, want to be like helpful and things like that. So don't think that they look down on you because they don't they were there like I said they were a freshman before so don't be afraid to talk to them um, don't go to them acting like you are that now and you know just be yourself and you'll make friends with them and it's no big deal like and don't try to act like you're better than anybody if you talk to upperclassmen and your friends don't like don't be that person just be cool relax and you will have a good freshman year it is okay it'll be okay I'm gonna do some more tip videos like this for you guys if you guys want to see more videos or you have any other questions about um, being a freshman or any other grade in high school you can leave them down below leave me questions about what you guys would like me to answer in another one and I'll do some tips for you or just answer the questions so yeah thank you guys so so much I really hope that video was a little bit helpful or like a little bit like calming in a way um to let you guys know that it'll be okay everybody was a freshman at some point we all have to do it we all have to get through it but it'll be okay you you a boss you gonna get through it you strong mentally you can do it so just think positive and you will get through it thank you guys again for watching my video don't forget to hit that red button the subscribe button join my family i need a family name if you guys have a family name that you guys think i should call like my family or something like that link it or link I don't know why I always say link comment it down below I would love to hear your suggestions don't forget to hit the notification bell next to it so you guys can be notified don't forget to also follow me on my social media it's always down below if you want to see my last video it'll be right here thank you guys so so much I love you so so much and I'll see you guys on my next video deuces